61A lecture number two, announcements. Announcements will appear on the course website, cs61a.org. Here's what it looks like. Here are the announcements. You can look back in time to see previous announcements. Today's announcements are that we've already released Lab Zero. This is a take-home lab, mostly about setting up your personal computer if you want to use one. You don't need a personal computer for this course. You can use our lab computers instead, in which case you should come configure those based on the description in Lab Zero. You can also learn how to get an EEX account, which you'll need in order to use our lab computers. You don't have to use our computers. You can use your own. It's up to you. I recommend trying to complete Lab Zero before you come to lab next week. If you get stuck, that's okay. You can ask questions during lab. Or we're holding special office hours this week, this Friday, from 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. in 611 Soda Hall to help you with Lab Zero or anything else. So if you get stuck, come ask questions. Homework 1 will be released shortly, and it's due next Thursday. It's perfectly normal to come in and talk to the course staff about homework questions if you get stuck. In order to start that process, we're going to have a homework party Monday evening. What's a homework party? It's just a time when you can come in and ask questions about the homework. Lots of other students will be there too. And so if there's a general explanation about a question, sometimes TAs will give it to the whole group instead of just one person at a time. I'll update this page with the time and place as soon as we can secure a location. Next week, I have some extra office hours on Monday afternoon that are open to talk about anything. So if you want to come tell me about some project you're working on or have questions about Berkeley, drop by. Live lecture will be in Zellerbach Hall on Friday of this week, but we move to Wheeler Hall next week. Please join Piazza if you haven't already. Please sign up for a section if you're enrolled. If you're still waitlisted or applying for concurrent enrollment, we're trying to make more room in section, and I suspect a bit more space will open up by Monday. I'll keep you posted. Also, the midterms for this course are scheduled. Please mark your calendars. We'll have the first one on Monday, the 10th of September, and the second one on Wednesday, the 17th of October. If you have a course conflict, please let us know and read the exam policy first so you know in advance what's going to happen.